Nepal football has some challenges, uh, but it's, it's no news. It's been some tough years for Nepal football. We have to be patient. We, we have to accept that, accept where we are at the moment and, and where we want to go. And it, it, it will take time to get results. Uh, you, you need to start every time with a new team. Uh, the first year is often about if you're going to, you can chase quick results or you can try to build for the long term. I think in five years, if, if Nepal football uh, work hard uh, and, and really focus on the football uh, and uh, then we can absolutely do big improvement. We said from the beginning we're going to start with uh, work with the shape of the team, uh, then we're going to start to work with the pressing game and uh, then we're going to start building an attacking game. Uh, now we, we're going to start with the pressing game. Uh, we, uh, we hope to train a lot. Uh, we have a problem in, in Nepal with pitches. Uh, we, we don't have uh, unlimited access to pitches, uh, so we, we can't do as many sessions as, as we want to do, and uh, pitches and, and weather conditions, but we can't do magic, no one can, so it, we have the pitches we have. Uh, but, but we work uh, hard with the players, now we have a pretty big squad uh, together and, uh, and work with organization pretty much, and, and then uh, next step is, is pressing game. Compared to other top teams like uh, Japan, Iran, Korea, it, it's uh, a long, long, long way to go. Uh, of course, uh, that's no secret. Uh, if you look, India has taken big steps the past five, five to ten years, uh, and uh, we have some steps to take there. Uh, so we, uh, the past five years has been tough on Nepali football. It's uh, other countries has uh, developed and. Uh, we haven't been able to do that because we had no league and, and so on. Uh, so at the moment, we're, we're not a top team in Asia, that, that's for sure. Uh, and uh, maybe it's not realistic to see that we're going to beat Japan and, and, and Iran in, in, in a couple of years. But uh, the ambition is to take steps all the time and, and be able to, first of all, compete with uh, at, for real at South Asian level to, to be able to challenge for the South Cup. Yes, if you see their infrastructure around the game, their organization uh, around the game, uh, so they, they, are, uh, they have taken big, big steps. Uh, and, but Moldes beat us uh, in, in South Games, so right now we have to accept that uh, Moldes uh, are ahead of us. But uh, I hope that we should be able to, to compete uh, with Moldes definitely in, in, uh, in, in a while at least, and, uh, and India in the long run. We know that we're going to have to uh, be pushed back in the World Cup qualifiers because the teams are strong and experienced and we need to be able to handle that. So, so we tried to find a uh, pretty strong team to, to play against. We will play now uh, against three strong teams. Malaysia was ranked lower than us, but uh, if everybody uh, who sees the team of Malaysia, sees every single one of their player is playing every week at a higher level than our most uh, famous player uh, who plays in Indonesia and I think the league in Malaysia is stronger than that one so week in and week out to play at a high level and uh, so it's I see it as a strong team uh, despite the ranking uh, quite is is a strong team uh, you see the results uh, last year uh, I mean you, you don't draw Egypt if you're not strong you don't beat UAE if you're not strong uh, uh, Taipei is ranked I'm not sure uh, 130 or something uh, and, and the ranking is always hard to, to, to discuss from but uh, it's, it's clearly a, a pretty strong team uh, so we, we try to find the games against uh, stronger teams but, but maybe not to play Japan uh, wouldn't really benefit us because uh, they're too strong I think the the weak side is uh, is organization uh, on the pitch, both in, in defense and, and offense, and uh, that's what we're trying to work on really hard. Uh, the, the tactical side of the game is, is in my opinion, the, the weaker side, uh, and we're trying to improve it. Uh, the strong side is, is Nepali players has, uh, are really good to work with. They really want to learn, and they work hard in training, and uh, uh, as long as you do that, you can de develop and improve. And the players are technical, the, the sound, uh, they uh, have good attitude on the pitch, they work hard, they're warriors. And, uh,
but, but the organization and tacti tactical part are, in my opinion, the, the side we need to improve. We need to, to get the players to spend more time on a training pitch. Uh, an Apollo player today don't train near as much as a European trainer, player. Uh, it's, it's a big difference in uh, training sessions over a year. Uh, Nepali players play a lot of games, but more games than a European player. But I think we need to spend more time on the training pitch because uh, that will improve our coaches and give the coaches a chance to, to really work on, on the tactical aspects of the game. Football is a running game. It is you, you need to run, but you need to use your brain when you run. If a player is injured and can't practice, uh, we don't pick him to the game. And for me, it's, it's natural uh, uh, to feel an unfit player. Uh, when you have fit players, it, it doesn't make sense, in, in my opinion. This fitness talk is, uh, is become a bit too big, the bigger than it actually are. I, uh, I don't have so much to say about it. It's, it's uh, been an incident and it's, it's, it's no secret. Uh, but now we, we look into that and then Anfa look into that and, and then we see where it, where it takes us. But right now I, I don't have so much comments about it. I, I don't really want to discuss the issue because right now it, it's... Uh, uh, I was away uh, back in Sweden when it happened and uh, it's... Uh, now Anfa is looking into it. Uh, overall it's, it's, a, it's a good... Uh, attitude in the squad. Uh, I think that we have a good connection with the players. So it's incidents happen. It's, it's you you work close together. Uh, you it's it's intense. Uh, people are tired and all that. So incident happens. It, it's no uh, not unique for for us. Uh, then it's a different level of incidents, of course. But uh, we look into this one, and, and before it's uh, that's done, I really don't want to say so much.